Ross Sprewell thought about a three, head fakes, now the two. They got Patrick Ewing here off the ball with a foul. They're going to count the basket. The block by Patrick Ewing, he's doing all the little things. No easy baskets for his team. You erase two, and what does it do? It leads to Allen Houston, the no-looker. Larry Johnson once again, the three. There's a five-point swing right there. And then the defensive rebound by Ewing. He leads it out. The pump fake, the up and under, and Sprewell gives New York a 17-point lead. Symbolic of the type of day it's been for Miami in Miami. Morning back on the floor, playing with five fouls. Sprewell. Tough move. Did it just own the perimeter right now? But Sean Leonard with that sore leg that he's had all season, the broken leg cannot guard him, and neither can Porter guard Allen Houston. They're having their way right now on the perimeter. 19 for Sprewell. New York by 24. Morning. Has it squirt out of his hands. And the Knicks take it back. Go back to Sprewell. Go to Allen Houston. Use some clock. In a few more minutes, unless Miami makes a furious run, Van Gundy can probably pull Ewing for good. Sprewell on the move! When you got a hot hand, you go to it, and you tell the other team, we're going to give you this until you stop it. And you know what? Sprewell has not been stopped all day. The Knicks came into this series firmly believing they could be competitive. In game one, they have been dominant. Sprewell is just backing his man down into the low post. This one with the little runner. And this is the Latrell Sprewell that Pat Riley also wanted here in Miami. New York got him, and today he's paying dividends.